You know how in every game series there was one bad game? Per se, that one. We already saw what happened to it. Or we go into the game desk and we see all these games, right? There's a bad one in each series. For, say, the Cy Cooper series, we have two, which was not very good. Sims, I guess you could say the pets really sucked. In Spyro, let's just not get started on that game right there. But And then, of course, we go down more. And we see this is a very common theme with every game series you got. We got Metal Gear Solid. The second one, in my opinion, wasn't quite as good as the third. Prince of yes! <laughs> Prince of Persia is the only series without this rule. Yeah. Ratchet and Clank, Deadlocked, could have been better. Yeah. God of War, both games perfect. Jack, so. that could have been better, the second one. And then the PS1 games could have been better, every single one wow. of them. So, Josh, who gets to play this one? You. No, no I insist. Nah, you. No, man. no, no, ladies first. No, it's your right, copy. No, no, no. I'm a dude. No. You're playing. No, you. Josh, play. Make me. Weenie. No. No. Lay on me! Every time! There. Josh, it doesn't have to be this way. Yes, it does. <laughs> have fun. Nerd. Every time, my friends, I get the crap. I mean, Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories is, uh... Who am I kidding? It's terrible. <sighs> Play the game, fanboy. We're not gonna put that in. That's a little... Hey, guys, we got a nice cut opening, which belies the crap that you're about to play. Well, at least it's quite similar to that of the first two games. Despite the GBA version sucking out loud. The so here we are, everyone. The presentation in this version is a lot better, in my opinion. You know, fully 3D, voice acting, the whole shebang. Remember how I said you'd be ticked off, though? I mean, I like the graphics first off, though. But you know why, uh, how I said you'd all be ticked off? You know why? Because it's technically the same thing, only 3D. Well, pretty much. Josh? Yes? Just... Uh... Watch. Okay, so what we got here uh, is a door, it's, and it's just broken. The cars are back. <laughs> Josh, contain yourself. And I'd also like to bring up another point. They have voice acting, which is actually good. What is this gay little jump sword has? Anyways, it's supposed to be like a flip sort of thing, like a combat sword. Anyways, I mean, I like the graphics, but again, I find it very annoying that you actually have to fight the Heartless the same way you already did. Only difference, it's in 3D. And it's not too, it's not like a uh, facing each other kind of thing. If you know what I mean, where you actually just have like one plane, you hit each other, and we, you, this looks familiar if you watch the entire review. It's the same thing. Only this time, there's more room to fight, and they said since there's more room, let's make it harder. That's what she said. Way harder. Here's Cloud. Recognize him? Cool guy, but anyway. He only does two swipes of the sword, and then he's gone. He's like, oh, oh good, Tinkerbell, me? whatever shall I do without her? It's like, oh. You know what? How do I run away from these fights? Oh, you just go to the border and wait for Oh, the yes, you can actually control. escape from fights now. Well, you could in the GBA version. Yeah, but a bit more simple. I find it very annoying. Indeed. Why try to escape from a King Hearts fight? Because they suck! But you know what I really like about this they game? They just blow! You actually hear Zexion's voice. I haven't beaten it yet, but I know what it sounds like. I'm very happy with it. Uh, he had to look up cutscenes on YouTube because he sucks that bad. I'm a fanboy, shut up. But again, I'm just saying because he sucks that bad at the game, that's why he had to look him up on YouTube. Because, well, he doesn't just have... He just doesn't have the masculinity to grow a pair and <sighs> beat the game like me. Because it's so bad. But they have the same journal thing. I think it's a theme with Kingdom Hearts, of course. But Axel's here. Everyone showed up in this game, which I enjoy that. But at just, the same time... Just about. But at the same time, here's another good point. Yeah, we're actually saying good things about this game. Just wait for a little here, bit, though. Here's a cutscene. Just, just watch this. Good cutscene, right? Who are you? I am Vexen. Yeah, that's the same guy who plays Uryu for all your Bleach fans, or Shino for all your Naruto fans. Worst voice ever for Vexen, but I'm liking the 3D. They actually don't call them cutscenes anymore either, they're events. 
But here is the holy mother load of crap. They make the this nearly game. nearly impossible boss fights. They make him impossible. I have not beaten him yet. That's the point. I have not been able to beat Vexen yet. Because they just overpower him. Yes, I can't even lock onto him. Well, why can't you? Just Because R it's not the R1 button anymore. Well, what button is it? I don't know, Josh. It's Oh, that's how you do slates. Okay. Just yeah. do something! Okay, that's how you jump. Uh, squares, dodge, drill. Ow. See how tough this is? It is not normal. Okay. Not at all. Oh, it's the R2 button. Convenient, ain't it? Well, at least it's on the right side of the... See, he breaks every control. single one of your cards. Yeah, it's, he's just got higher value cards than you. Which no is, matter what you do, and you can't get around him, and that's the only way to hit him. That's See, just... He spins with you! I mean, plus, he, like, shoots homing missiles at you, bashes the crap out of you with a shield. Yeah, Tinkerbell's really gonna help me in this predicament. Yeah, I so can you can't get behind him, and how do you hit him? Guess what? You have to get behind him. Guess what? I have not gotten rid of a single bar yet. He's almost killed me. Yeah, just about. He's like two-thirds of... I mean, two-thirds of your oh, health good. are pretty much gone. Oh, you yeah, there's a the recharge. Good stuff, huh? Yeah. Boy, I'm tired with, of this game. At least with Riku, you don't have to put up with that garbage. But that's only one step back from how crappy this game really is. But really, Riku, you have to actually wait to get to the good part of this game. That's the only part I found worth the game. Well, there's only one redeeming factor in this I game. have not been able to hit him with a single card, my god. Good lord. Guys, don't call me sissies for this either. It's freaking hard. That's what she said. I mean, my lord. You know Square, what? Square Enix promised us something when they came out with this remake stateside. But they just messed up really bad. No, they messed up redoing the game itself. They messed up big time. Watch the death scene. This is really happy looking. Ah! Ah, look at me and my dying. Ah. And there he is floating. Just like And the other dead. Titles. This, my friend, sums up the entire game. Death. Around every corner. And you will be getting used to this picture. Be fair, or just always be ready to look at Sora's lifeless body floating in a sea of darkness. It will be burning your brain, my friends. That's all I have to say. Josh, do what you need to do. <laughs> say goodbye, my friends. Josh, <laughs> you're free. Do what you need. Got some air time. Boy, that 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 dog didn't see it coming. Nice one. <laughs>